Now, the Royal Festival Hall in London was on fire this evening as the Prince and Princess of Wales, William and Catherine, put on a united, <laughs> united front <laughs> as they showed up for the Royal Variety performance. Mm, this follows all of these ridiculous claims and controversies <laughs> made by Omid Scooby, royal biographer. Omid Scooby. <laughs> In his controversial book, Endgame, where he accidentally, we are told, accidentally <laughs> revealed the names of the senior royals he claims to have made those racist remarks against Meghan and Prince Harry's unborn child. Mm, those names apparently have gone on to be released by um, Piers Morgan, who said that if the Dutch people know who those senior royals are, then the British public needs to know as well. So he went on to reveal those names on his program earlier, but that hasn't changed people's perception of Meghan, Harry, Omid, Scooby, this whole endgame fracas. <laughs> it hasn't at all. <laughs> okay, people still look at these claims as a pack of lies. William and Catherine showed up looking very strong very loved up now if you saw them walking into royal festival hall on that first greeting prince william took a tiny step back allowing wife catherine to step ahead and do those handshakes first and that is all because prince william was saying to catherine listen own it you haven't done anything wrong. This is your moment to tell the whole world out there that we are standing, you know, together and these claims flying around are not going to stop us from showing up and doing a great job. And that is what William and Catherine did, turning up for those royal variety performances at the Royal Festival Hall this evening. Have you seen William and Catherine show up looking very elegant? Catherine in that magical gown. Prince William all smart in his tuxedo with that black bow tie. <laughs> we are told that they are going to be treated to a lot of performances, including Cher. Is it Cher? I don't know how they pronounce that name, but she is one of my favorite do you believe in love after love <laughs> that song played back in those days and it still rings a bell in you know the millennials you you will know what i mean but yes william and catherine have today showed up indeed very very united very strong and Prince, of course, King Charles as well is in Dubai as we speak right now for the climate change conference. And again, the king wasn't faced at all by these allegations. He has turned up to do a great job like he usually does. He seemed not faced at all. The royal family is stepping forward regardless of all of these claims that are trying to pull it down. Okay, and since these claims started flying around, Meghan and Harry uh, have taken that back step. No hear of them. <laughs> mm, they are very quiet. And I don't think this book has done anything good to them, if at all, not further damaged their reputation what are your thoughts leave them in the comments section below what do you think about william and catherine's showing up as a united front for the royal variety performances what do you think about king charles 
showing up as strong as ever for the climate change conference in Dubai. But I mean, the senior royals that were named in this book, controversial book, as the ones that made those racist comments clearly are being targeted because these are again some of the most adorable royals. And I think for Omid Scooby, Meghan and Harry, I think they thought that um, attacking these royals who are seen as right there at the center or at the heart of the royal family is what is going to weaken the institution. But Omid Scooby, Meghan Harry are all wrong because I think this has in fact added more air into the balloon. <laughs> it has added more strength, more energy, more love for the royal family. What are your thoughts, guys? I would love to see uh, what you think about these stories in the comments section below. Stay subscribed.